Welcome back. Pisces, how are you? Last but not least, see little bit of fishies. How are you guys today? I have your messages for the month of April. So let's get started. Y'all the only one that got bass in y'all with somebody's music playing. I try not to get no background. Y'all the only one got that bumping noise in the back. Oh, the green, the fairy of the green world, the natural world needs you. Mm. The sea storm, the calm, amid chaos, the sweet beacon fairy guidance. But where will you? Where will it lead you to a powerful personal growth? Third party here, number 44, angel 44, number five for the change under the sun, things of the calm and of the chaos. Mm, calm in a storm, natural world needs you. The natural world needs you. All right, let's see you guys what they got going for you guys on Pisces for the month of April. Nine of Earth, abundance coming in. Now we got patience. If you want that abundance to come, you got to be patient. And then they had the Queen of Air, so you might have an air sign in your energy. Uh, earth sign in your energy. These cards are so heavy. I, that's, I think that's why I stopped using these cards. But they're so heavy. They shuffle good, but they're so heavy. King of water. And light at the same time. And that was the eighth ace of earth. I'm not going to take it because it hit the floor. But that was the ace of earth. And that's the Queen of Fire and the Ten of Earth. So you went from the Nine to the Ten in the energy. So it is a completion here out of the Two of Air, Two of Swords, cutting something off, something out, cutting somebody out, cutting somebody off, past situation, a job, a um, business, something here that's being cut out or cut off. A woman it looked like a, a, a fire sign at that. Somebody that you was patiently waiting for, but then she caused some kind of problem, some kind of calm chaos or amid chaos. But they made you emotional about it. Mm, ten of Earth, Ten of Pentacles, and that um, Queen of Air. But it's two different women here: Queen of Fire and Queen of Water. And then we got the um, the Nine of Earth, another woman. And this woman is waiting for this King of Pentacles. The one that's got this calm, amid chaos. They keep that under wraps. That calm, amid chaos. Talk about it here. It's a third party here. I don't know if I said that before. Yeah, there's somebody crossing boundaries here. Somebody's sleeping around and not telling another person that they are. This is a flirt. You got a flirt here. A flirt, Pisces. Um, sexual freedom. So they thought they broke up with you so they could go sleep with somebody else. But even if y'all still together, they might tell people y'all broke up. Um, under love. Yeah, y'all still lovers. Y'all still lovers under the distorted feminine. So she might be sleeping around. The feminine in this energy might be sleeping around and re re um, resolving conflict. Somebody definitely is causing conflict by offer to a masculine or a masculine offer to a feminine here in this energy as well um, what are y'all offering what are y'all offering what y'all offering on these boundaries what y'all offering a sacred spiral with, sp with, with spiders so this is some type of webbed energy. Um, you are an infinite being. So, but this is still tangled up. It's like 
It's still tangled up. I'm surprised the entangled card didn't come out. And it came out a couple of times since I've been reading The Way Out. Something good is on its way. And then it birthing a new life. Okay, so I told you we came in this energy. Something was different here. Birthing a new life. All right, so that's what hit the table. I have to take that. And it says, allow success and good fortune into your life. This is a part of the greater collective. So... Pisces, commanding performance. This is renewing your promise. In love, though. In love. This is a love. Somebody wants somebody back. Somebody wants to reconciliate with somebody. Somebody transformed. They want this person back now. They've gathered enough energy. They gathered enough um, information with the squirrels. And you might even see squirrels. Um, you might even see butterflies now. Um, yeah, two horses, they are having wild sex under this new life. Something good is on its way. You will have, you know, it will come in like a stampede. If it ain't come in like a stampede and y'all stay strong, structured together, y'all gonna have roots together. But this spiral here, this is somebody you're gonna have to mix out because this person came in under the witch the natural world needs you she's naturally nasty this this person might got a natural a natural let me get one card from the green witch because she, she came out i might as well just one please just one for the boundaries ace of wands so this is about sex ace of wands sorry for the reflection ace of wands um yeah that's that you guys that's all that's that's well that's that because there's boundaries set here and i'm looking for the other deck all right let's get it on to the boundaries stuff is all turned over hold on the whole deck is turned. Hold on. Hold on. All right. Hold on. Just a sec. All right. So, boundaries. Baby steps. Baby steps. Take your time. Don't go too fast. Take your time. Take your time. Before somebody change their mind, take your time. You are an infinite being. Take your time. Ain't no rush. Blaze Bazinga. That is Big Bang Theory. Bazinga. Because there's a theory that this person is playing head games. Bazinga. This person is playing head games with you. Sticky wicked. It's sticky and wicked at the end of the day. Because as I told you, this is a witch. Passionate. She uses sex as her weapon. Woot, woot. Woot, woot. And they proud of it too. Woot, woot. <laughs> oh, they proud of they so. The music right along. And they don't have a care in the world about who they sleep with. Come back home, smile, grin, kiss you. Just like ain't nothing happened. <laughs> wow. All right, let's see the real. Let's see. Let's see some tarot on it. And then I'm going to say I'm going to catch you guys later. Divi this distorted feminine. Baby steps. Back to back. Two of wands. Back to back with each other. Yeah. You ain't going to trust this woman. Y'all going to be back to back with each other. Ten of swords. I mean, ten of wands. Carrying a heavy burden under the sticky wicket. And this is a bad boy or bad girl energy. King of... King of wands king of passion and, and i told you when she came in she came under the ace of wands that's the commonality they have in it and this is also the judgment so it's gonna be some judgment here about who she been with who he been with and then it's the world they've been sleeping around in this world 
All right, and at the bottom of the deck is the Three of Wands, okay? Three of Wands talking about they still surveying more options. Other people, you know what I mean? Other circumstances that they want to give passion to with the Wands. Other men, okay? Other women or women and energy, okay? And then what else we got? Let me get some prayer on that. That's the last one of the energy. I'm going to just give you some angel messages, okay? To close us out. 12 Zodiac. That is self-love. Self-love, the angels are encouraging you to take a take care of your own needs. Divine intervention, divine is stepping in. Spirit is carrying you through your difficult time. Trust in the higher power. And one more, surrendering to spirit. Hand your situation over to the divine and let go of your attachments to the outcome. Okay, Pisces, that has been your message for the month of April. Check back with me in May to see if your energy has changed. Namaste and Namaskar.